What's up everybody, it's time for some Omnath Road Rage right here. We've got a bunch of fun way to make a bunch of elemental tokens with Omnath. We have stuff like Doubling Season, Parallel Lives, Impact Tremors, so we have a lot of fun enchantments in this deck. We also run, um, I don't know, it's just uh, some good stuff, red-green. Let's see what we're up against. Not really a straight win condition with this deck, other than just like, let's get some creatures down, let's beat some face. So our opponent is left with the tough decision of figuring out... Okay, he does. He decides he wants to go first. Who are we up against? Crash the Blood Braided. Whenever another creature dies, you may put X counters on Crash, where X is that creature's power. Okay. This seems like a nice little fun Duke em out game. We got Heat Stroke to kind of make it... Yeah, I like this. Dragon Throne. Gain some life. Yeah, this is good. We're going to keep. So we're looking at one, two, we've got three mana, one from Farseek. We need to get a little bit more mana, then we can uh, hopefully hit one of our mana rocks. Ooh, Tooth and Nail, yes. I will take that. So let's get down Catacombs, pass the turn. So I run, uh, you know, it's just some fun stuff in here. We have Heat Stroke, so we're going to get in a lot of tokens. So, you know, we're going to be swinging in with them. And if we have Heat Stroke, it kind of keeps the board a little less muddy down. So that's one way to do it. Real fun. Fits in with the uh, the Road Rage theme. I don't know, Omnath's mad about something. Who knows what he's mad about. So let's put uh, Taiga. Yeah, grab Taiga. And then we're going to get down Mountain and probably Farseek this turn. We get into doubling season. Okay, I like that. So let's get down... Yeah, let's get down Mountain. We're going to Farseek. Helps if we tap for green. There we go. And grab, yeah, we'll just grab Mountain, because that's the only thing we can take. <laughs> I forgot Farseek doesn't, it has, doesn't have the Forest Clause on there. It's such a green card, too. Ooh, looks like our opponent misses Land Drop. That's not fun. So we'll get down Stomping Ground. Do we want to shock it in? I think I'd much rather get down Haro, so no, we're not going to play. We're going to Haro real quick. Sacrifice the mountain. Gonna grab two forest. And then, yeah, I'll pass the turn. So we're looking at, we've got five mana. We need to get two more mana. And then we get some Omnath action going. As far as mana accelerants in here, I do have Generator Servant. So we can sack him, and then whatever creature we cast will have haste. We also have, um, you know, Soul Ring, Mana Crypt, Mana Vault, stuff like that to kind of edge out that early. But you need to run a lot of like Haro and Farseek because that double double red, double green is pretty hard. Sometimes it's a little hard to meet if you run too many mana rocks. Okay, so we have five mana. What do we want to do? We get down doubling season. Let's do that. Let's get down doubling season. Don't want to get down uh, crossroads right now just because in case he gets his commander down or he does something funny and I had to have all his creatures get face. So the way this deck kind of plays out is you're looking to ramp into Omnath and then just kind of set up with a bunch of enchantments or draw into like a tooth and nail or something like that, heat stroke. You're trying to just set it up to where you can get Omnath down and then just start having a lot of fun. So he blood braids into expedition map. He could have swung in right there. He had haste, but uh, not sure what happened. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, five mana. We'll have six mana next turn, or seven mana with Grill Turf. So right now, let's get down. We're looking at Entwine for nine. Yeah, I'd like to hit that. So I'm gonna hold on to that. So let's let's get down Heat Stroke. Let's turn the oven up on our opponent right now. Put down Grill Turf. Bounce, uh, we'll just bounce the force back to our hand. And I'll have enough mana for Crash, so I'm going to hold off on getting Crossroads down. We could. So we'll have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We'll have just enough to get Omnath down next turn. So, yeah, I like that. We're, we're going to hold off on getting Crossroads down. I'm going to time it to where hopefully we can get a couple Elementals and then get that down. But talk about some sweet art right there. Let's move Omnath out of the way. Look at that, man. Heat stroke. Got the suns beating down on everybody. Oh, yeah. I like it. 
And since we kind of have a, it really fits well in the Zomnat deck, since we have like kind of a reoccurring army with these 5-5 five, five elementals. Now, our opponent is sitting at 5 mana. He does have Expedition Map, so he can crack the... Well, he gets into some black mana with Elves of Deep Shadow, but it doesn't... So if we had Crossroads out, it had Haste to be able to tap that. So I'm glad we didn't put that out, because he could have gotten his... Uh, well, that would have been 1, 2, 3... Yeah, it would have been enough to get his commander down and have it Haste. So I'm glad we held off on the Crossroads. So he's going to come in for 3. Okay, let's see. We've drawn the Sylvan Tutor. That's not bad. We can get down Master of the Wild Hunt with that if we want to. Get some extra tokens off Doubling Season. Or we could tutor for Sakura Tribe Elder. I'm going to give it a shot. I want to get down Omnath. So let's get down Omnath. And if we want to tutor next turn... Well, would we rather wait till to get down? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we have seven. Yeah, let's. I'm going to go ahead and get down on that. I'd like to get some action going. Well, if we draw into land next turn, we do. All right, Omnath. He's angry, man. Look at that. Look how angry his arms are. He's full of rage right now. So our opponent cracks his uh, expedition map. Now if this Omnath sticks and we can draw into a land next turn, then um, we've got Shamic Revelation. Draw into a couple cards with that. We get our little elemental army, we get Dragon Throne. I think Omnath would like sitting in that little Dragon Throne. He'd look good in there. And we can always Tooth and Nail for... Uh, we have Crater Hoof in here. And... We'll just grab another creature. We have, um, if we get enough elementals, we have the the bridge, Moss Troll Bridge. So we can tap all of our creatures and give them, like, stupid, like, plus 20 or something like that. So that may be our tooth and nail for bridge and uh, crater hoof. Hopefully he doesn't have a removal spell. He did, um, we'll see, we'll see. We'll see what happens. And this looks like his commander. He's getting down. Okay, he's getting his commander out. I feel good about that now. Hopefully we'll draw into a, a, uh, a land. That's what we're looking for. Ooh, is this a term? Terror. Destroy target non-black creature. Okay, yeah, you got it, man. That's weird that it's uh, readied out like that. I like the art on Terror, though. Alright, so swings in for three. Draw into Temple. Let's get on math up before we forget about them. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have enough to tooth and nail. Let's I'm gonna hold off on tooth and nail. We could go cr crater hoop, but we don't really we won't really have that much of an effect. And we're looking at nine, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We can read. Let's let's give Omnath one more shot, since we drew into a temple. All right, there we go. And we can, we can have some fun next turn. Definitely, we're definitely in line for tooth and nail. And um, dragon throne. We get some elements. Yeah, yeah, we're good. We're good. Hopefully, he doesn't have another removal spell. And if he does, then we're gonna tooth and nail next turn. See if we can't get into something. Some fun road rage action. Oh man, bummer. Yeah, man. When you've got a commander that costs seven, and your opponent is just uh... oh, when it dies. Okay, good. I thought it was enter the battlefield. Okay, I feel a lot better now. Does he, he doesn't have a sack outlet, right? Yeah. No sack outlet, but we do have heat strokes. We gotta watch out for heat strokes, so we're not gonna block. So whatever he comes in, we got the oven turned up. But uh, Omnath, he's full of rage. He knows what's going on. He knows I handled the oven. So even if he does get the gatekeeper down, once we get these elementals going, we'll have enough to make sure we stay stay in front of that. Don't have to sacrifice Omnath. So 
opponent's tapping for four right now. Let's got my magic fingers crossed that it is not. Okay, I'll take that. Cascades into an explore. Okay. So he's gonna come in for three. I, I like this guy's build. It's a pretty cool, sweet little uh, deck he's got. So we're looking at uh, four, seven, eight. Well, the, he can't swing in. So we're looking at seven. We're gonna cast the explore, I think. No, he already cast it off the cascade. Excuse me. Oh man. Bomber, you drew into a prey upon. Ugh. Okay, you got it, man. So he's gonna put that many plus one counters. We have to sacrifice Omnath. He's gonna get, I think, just two. No, he gets one counter, so it goes to four four. So we're gonna have to tooth the nail next turn. So he's coming in for eight? Yeah, he's coming in for eight. Okay. See what we're drawn to. Oracle. Yeah, let's go ahead and uh one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're gonna go in Yeah, entwine. Oops, don't want to do that. Tap for double red green. Two colorless. Got three more. Make sure we get Omnath up. Don't want to forget about Omnath. If I don't get the commander up, sometimes I forget about it. So we're going to tooth and nail. I'm going to grab Crater Hoof. And we can grab his commander. Now, here's the deal. Tooth and nail. So we have Kiki Jiki and we have Zealous Conscripts. I don't really like infinite combos in Commander. I'm not a huge fan of it. So what we can do is we can grab Crater Hoof and the Savage Vent Maw, and we'll get that extra mana and we get some more stuff down. Yeah, let's do that. I I just I'm not a huge fan of infinite combos. If we draw into it, I'll do it, but I don't want to go for it right now. That's just how I like to play. So we're gonna get Crater Hoof and the Savage Vent Maw. That way we get the extra mana. I don't want to like misclick on something because I did click on the Savage Vent Maw. And so we're going to put Vent Maw and Crater Hoof. Okay. Yeah, right there. So we're going to get that six mana from Savage Vent Maw. Get down Oracle, get down Tutor. Yeah, let's do this. Oh, he doesn't. He doesn't have haste. I thought that's right. It, it doesn't grant all of them haste, but it's easy, it's good to have that. So we're swinging for seven. Yeah, I missed that. For some reason, I thought um, Hater, Crater Hoof gave them haste. I forgot that he has haste. It's one of those things where it just the card jumbles inside of your head. Your heart was in the right place. But yeah, I'm yeah. I play commander. I like to have fun, man. I like to have interesting matches. Um, we could have Kiki Jiki and Zell's conscript right there, but I don't know. I like building a fun little board state. Um, you know, I'm gonna start recording more modern content soon, and so you know, little hard combo locks like that. You know, that's fun for modern. But when I play commander, man, it's uh, we're gonna have some fun. You know, we could close out the game right there, but. Uh, Let's see what kind of, I'd like to see what kind of trouble we can get into, get into. That that's what I like to do. And uh I don't have Xenagos in the deck. I, I just don't have Xenagos. I have I haven't bought the card. I, I can't remember how much the card costs. I thought it was like um five, six, ten tickets, something like that. I can't remember. But um Xenagos would have been a very good target for tooth and nail. If you wanted to if you're building a Omnath deck that's gonna have tooth and nail, Xenagos is a very good target. You can search up uh <laughs> Xenagos and Emrakul, if that's what you want to do. So our opponent's got one, two, three, four, five, six, six mana. What would it get into the air next turn? We're not going to block. Ooh, well, never mind. Whenever it attacks, we'll still get that mana, and if he blocks, he'll die from heat stroke. So, I'm okay with that. So, what do we want to do? We've got nine mana, ten. How much is Omnath again? Let's see. Looking at um, 11 mana on Omnath. 
So let's get down the panorama. Let's get down Oracle, see what's on top. And we're going to save this Jun panorama just in case we get into some more Omnath action. Let's play the forest. <laughs> Moss Bridge Trolls on top, alright. Um, okay, so if we get into Moss Bridge, we can set up a bunch of, give it plus 20, plus 20, and give it Trample with dra uh, Dragon Dragon Throne of Tarkir. So let's do that. So we're going to get down Dragon Throne. And then we'll tap this... Uh, no. Okay, we're good. Yeah, we're good. Okay. So we're going to draw a uh, Moss Bridge Troll next turn. We can get Moss Bridge down. And if our opponent wants to swing in... We, we may go ahead and block. We can do that. So we're looking next turn. Getting down... The, we'll have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We have enough to get Omnath down if we want to. But we can also get Dragon Throne onto Crater Hoof, activate it, so you're looking at 5 for that to equip and activate, and once we get Moss Bridge down, we can give it haste with Catacombs, and we have enough power to tap them all, well we won't be able to tap, yeah, we won't be able to tap Crater Hoof with the Dragon Thrones, but, so we may go for an Omnath next turn, get Omnath down, and then set up a bigger swing in next turn. Okay, so he's got Lightning Greaves. But luckily with Heat Stroke, this really complicates the the swinging in aspect because it's going to kill anything. that. So he, no matter how many counters he gets on his crash, um, if we declare a blocker, it's going to kill... It, it kills uh, each creature that was blocked or blocked. And... Oh, and the Dragon Throne's artifact, it gives... Plus damage to um, to everybody, so we can swing in with that. Um, so if we block with Savage, I don't want him to activate the Steel Hellkite, so we're gonna block with the Savage guy right there. That way we keep it all on the ground. So you can put that many plus one counters on there. And it doesn't have trample, so we're not worried about the counters on there. And so now his Steel Hell Kite's going to die from Heat Stroke. Didn't drink enough water, buddy, did you? Nope. He's going to get those counters on there, and as long as we just stay ahead of his commander with elemental tokens, we'll be good with Heat Stroke. And once we get out of this combat step, the board will go back to being normal. There we go. Okay. So we're looking at probably getting down Omnath next turn. Oh, he's going to bring back Steel Hell Kite. Okay. Not too worried about. It. I mean, you know, it's it. He animated it, but we're gonna make it work. So mana vault on top. Let's get down Omnath. So we're looking at double red, double green, green red. One, two, three, four, five, six. And one more. Now, if he wants to, he can heat stroke. But we at least have a Jun panorama, so we can sack that, grab a land to get an elemental elemental token, and then we can set up a really big swing next turn. We can get on Crossroads, Sylvan Tutor. We can also draw a bunch of life with the the Revelation. Draw some cards too. As long as he doesn't have a removal spell for Omnath, we should be good. And as far as activating Hellkite, he's got one, two, three, four. Well, he's tapping for some mana right now, so let's see what he does.
But another option is we can get down Dragon Throne, or we can get down Moss Bridge. Tap that, give it plus 20. So we're looking at 7 for that. 5, that's 11. Yeah, we'll have enough mana to activate in if we get some elementals going. And since it can't be destroyed, it'll be regenerated through heat stroke. So he definitely drank his Gatorade for today. Okay, let's see what he does. So if he swings in, basically heat stroke is all our creatures death touch. So he's gonna swing with the steel Hellkite. Let's see what he pops. So he's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So he doesn't have enough. Ni well, yeah, he does have enough mana to kill Omnath. That's what he wants to do. Since he's dealt damage, he can destroy each non-land permanent. Yeah, an 8 would take out Crater Hoof. No, well, Crater Hoof is 8, and Omnath is 7. So we'll, let's see what he does as far as activation goes. I think he did that for 4? Okay, yeah, I'll take that. I'll, I'll leave a Heat Stroke and an Omnath out there. I like that. Now, we do have Jun Panorama, so we can get a lane. If we draw another lane, that'd be awesome. But I think, I forgot what was on top. Um, Mana Vault. Mana Vault's on top. Oh, bummer, man. Ugh, I wanted Omnath to stick, man. Oh, well. We're, we're going to make it work, so let's see. Let's get down Mana Vault. Yeah, get down Mana Vault. Let's see how much Omnath is again. So we're looking at 9, we're looking at uh, 13 mana. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Um, he's going to be able to do Hell sp Spell, Steal Hellkite again. Um, Man, I'm, I'm going to try one more Omnath. I'm going to see if we can't set it up. Let's go. Let's go Omnath one more go. We should have enough mana, I think. So we got three right there. Let's go double right there. Tap for green. One, two. Three, four, five, six. Okay, there we go. Let's go. Let's see. Let's see what we can get into. Now he's going to have, he can pretty much blow up whatever he wants with this Hellkite. But he is tapping six. He's tapping for seven. Whoa, violent outburst. Oh. Oh, oh, the humanity. Okay, man, you got this game. Good game, dude. Whew, slug through that fest right there. But yeah, you know, that's a pretty good little crash game on his part right there. So I'll, still, I'll, I'll probably still go and post this. You know, this is a nice little... We tried to get some stuff going over here. It's fun playing with the heat stroke. Could have had the win with uh, Kiki Jiki and... Uh, Zell's Conscript, but you know, we're here to have fun. So, all right, if you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. Thanks, guys.